my father will need further management because from this point on we need to know at what stage the cancer is at histology is, does not identify the stage he will need to come to, he needed that's why they forwarded him to knh where they can now do further investigations to do uh, to, 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 to know the stage and also they need to know whether it has metastasized or not and that is why the doctor told us when we are going for our appointment which we, we were given now hello guys it's your girl patient status welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel if it's your first time here make sure you hit the subscription box and put on the notification bell so that you don't forget time across a new video remember i'm the queen of online gossip so welcome to today's video don't forget to give it a like and leave a comment on the comment section Jinga hii, taka taka. Nimekuambia kumbafu. And there's nothing you can do to me, Jinga. And don't even make me mention the sickness that you is almost similar to what Nani Magi is dealing with. Ngoja nitafungua live yangu. Taka taka umbo hii. Haya. Ebu block ini hii nini iende na patipati zake? Block that anything in inakuja hapa imevaa uniform ya nyako umbwa ya Germany toa haraka haraka ibebe patpati ikienda wasisahau patpati chapa mgongo zao na patpati mkienda moderators piga nyuma ya kichwa na patpati patpati yao wakitoka toa hiyo ingine hiyo umbwa inajita wilkista hapa ati mtu anajita wilkista nyako taka taka hii hata ujieshimu you hate yourself you can't even use your old name ati unabeba jina ya mwanamke mwenzako ati ndio unatembea nayo ndio unajiita ala taka taka wewe ati ilikista yako useless people who do not have independence and thinking in their heads unafuata mtu unafuata mwizi jambazi ati mpaka unajiita jina yake taka taka ujieshimu Atunajita unaacha mpaka jina yako we mwenyewe una, you abandon your own name and you are calling yourself somebody else's name and you think you're normal alafu unakuja you're making your presence in my space a space of objectivity you have no shame you have no fear you don't respect yourself anybody coming here na uniform ya war shakahola direct na wabebe magunia zao na omo yenye wanapanguza nayo matako ya watu wenye wanalamba hapa kwa TikTok Tova. Peleka pamoja na huyu Roches Junior, mwenye ni mbaba mwenye ako for something na anajiita Junior kwa TikTok. Taka taka hii toka kwa love yangu. Jinga hii. Sinilete useless. So, I was as I was saying, the onus of verification of documents lies with the people who are in doubt. And as it has been standard procedure on this platform, we are going to make sure that if there is going to be mchango here, yes, there is a right for people to see documents. But we are not going to bow down to mediocrity. Mtu mwenye anataka kuprove kama huyu ni baba ya magi, anaeza akaenda kwa kina magi, aende akatafute documents huko. You can as well go to the births and deaths registration. Go and verify. That is not our business. Ati mnasema mnataka DNA. Bull fucking shit. Stupid people. We will put the documents here. Anybody who feels dissatisfied with the documents can stay away from the mchango. And anybody who feels dissatisfied can go to Meru and can also go to the Kenyatta National Hospital. A lot of you keep yapping and screaming and yelling about NHIF. NHIF actually does not cover everything. Treating cancer, especially in Kenya, is very expensive. It takes a lot. It covers partial treatments. Some of you just like to open your mouths because you're excited about talking. And we do understand that Magitacha has not been perfect on this platform, so have I. And that does not mean I'm not human. I am human. Things will happen even to me. So you think that because of my imperfections, you deserve to judge me and put me down when I need help. Those who want to support me and believe in what I am saying will support me regardless. Yani mpaka nikashangaa. Hata ule nini. 
cotton mouth wa, wa UK ati alipata courage ku address magi personally that cotton mouth came here and lied that she has cancer anafa kunyamaza ji watu wakiongelelea cancer hapa si prosa magi you can start and also let me make this clear anybody who has a question for magitacha with regards to what she's going to be putting out here please moderators they are free to come up so they are free to come up and ask magitacha questions based on what she's going to be putting here kama uko na vendetta na magitacha unataka kumuliza kwa nini alilala na bwana yako ama kwa nini anatongozana na mwanaume kwa tiktok take that shit somewhere else if you're gonna come up here just know you're gonna ask her anything to do with the medical records and everything so, so that is all Maybe you can start Never okay the, um the, okay the, thank you for the opportunity um and thank you for this platform i appreciate so much your support and thank you for standing with me in this trying time so uh like i said yesterday uh my dad has been unwell for some months now and for a while he had been misdiagnosed he, actually the treatment he was getting people thought, uh, the doctors thought that he was having pelvic ulcers disease uh, but so uh, it ended up that it wasn't ulcers it was it, it wasn't peptic ulcers it was basically cancer that was growing and it has not been discovered and i described on how uh, his condition was worsening he was reducing a lot of weight uh he was not eating um he was weak and so and vomiting blood at some point and so i will start from the point i don't need to go I, uh, to, to, i'm not going into those nitty-gritties i don't know at it now you want me to come and bring you uh, the omeprazos and all the, uh, the, the 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 kids the peptic uh, ulcer kits that he has been taking so i am starting from the point where now he began vomiting blood and we realized something was wrong and he was taken to an hospital and he was admitted there and uh, that day is when he did not have a pulse and i now want to put the discharge summary of the latest hospital that he left he has been to many hospitals since 2020 but i'm putting for you guys the latest summary here just a minute um first of all before you put out anything i wanted to ask a question so you make it very clear here maggie tata yeah this is this yes. is your biological dad yes this is my biological father the father that gave birth to me the father that raised me i don't have any fathers i have i have not had any two fathers and i have never at any time uh d and diana announced on this platform that my father is late and anybody that has evidence that my father is late but i heard yesterday people were saying that my father died in 2013 please anybody with proof or evidence that my father died in 2013 and because it is said that, that i came on this platform uh that uh, ayeko was doing uh something for me in a platform i don't even remember ayeko doing anything for me in a platform in kasemekana she was doing some function for me in a platform and i started giving people my life story nani kasema that i lost my father in 2013 please anybody with a recording of me saying that i lost my father in 2013 we let it up early because i have never at any time announced that my father is dead or my father is late my father is alive my father is kicking that is the father that gave birth to me and that is all i can say dear. that is my okay. father biological thank you, guys. father yeah thank you ebu tapuru tapuru guys tapuru tapuru juu live iko na kazi yake ingine inakuja after this magi is only here for a few minutes so by the way i'll watch where is this this i'll watch is this nani i'll watch that is here ebu kama i'll watch because we want a neutral person i'll watch kama uko hapa you can send a, a request because these are medical documents you can you nini you can send a request and come here and tell us 
Yes, because ah, uh, Magi, Magi, Magi. Hmm? Zinaonekana vizuri. Ni nitasoma mali ya waoni I'm gonna read it out. Oh, uh, just a minute. Oh. Uh. Oh, uh, I don't know. Ninatoke hapo. Oh. Uh, Wacha nisonge. Mm. I don't know why. Mbona inanionyesha? Okay, there. Inaonekana but it's not very clear. It is not okay. very very okay. clear. Uh, how do we do about uh, it? Um, or you can um, try to can you try to post it? Can you try to post it on your side? Uh, no, no, no. I really cannot post it on my side because if I do, that's gonna affect my account. That's your that's why I wanted you to upload it. So now this okay. is just a discharge summary, but see it's not visible to be honest. Um I think that um Ebu Ebus, you did you send this to me? Yes, Ukonayo. Angalia the Zuri Rutayona. Okay. Okay, my D, yeah, I'm wish I gonna I gonna your blue. Yeah, you met my wish angalia i gonna blue. That last one, the actual, the, the actual, the the you gonna keep on me, the discharge summary, you gonna, you gonna in it, you gonna blue, you just put in black and white. Guys, is it more visible? Mona hiyo, unaona hiyo nilikuwa nimekutumia, umeona hiyo? Eh, hiyo nimeiona. Yes, unaona yangu iko more visible. Ushinda yangu. Yeah. Guys, can you see? Maybe you can like uh, nini? Maybe eh, you can like but, post them. Nila, unajua mimi sifai kuweka hizi. Because hizi nini zetu kuna very sensitive. Hizi hapa. Eh, angalia hiyo discharge summary, angalia hiyo discharge summary kwanza, angalia kama Angalia kama iko in black and white. Um now listen. No one. Inaonekana teri, very visible. Okay. Okay. Yes. Watu wana nyingine. Wacha let me put another. One. Eh weka nyingine. Yeah, that one too is okay. visible. Um, I explain in in in. Okay, this one, guys, was in July. In July, yeah. There is some background noise on your side. I don't know what it is about. Yeah, I corrected it. Okay. Um, so D. This is a, a full hemogram that was done after he went to the hospital with uh, with vomiting. So just a minute. Uh, the, that, so if you check that full hemogram, you go where the HB is. You will see at the time that was on twenty seventh of July, the HB was twelve point five GDL, uh, which was okay at the time. Uh, but in a span of between that 27th and uh, the mid-August, the, around the 14th of August, the HB, in, in, in that span of time, in a span of two weeks, the HB had dropped from that 12.5 to 8 GDLs. The 8 GDLs, ziko kwa hiyo discharge summary, nye mungu mnasema yonekani clearly. Okay. Let me put another document. 
and this was a di at, uh, actually a different hospital where these um okay now this right here uh now yes uh somebody was talking about nhif this was the latest bill we paid at the hospital where, where it was the his latest admission we've had many admissions like these ones but the, the latest admission is this one uh the bill came to the bill came uh, this is what I, what you're seeing here Where your next slide? For, for the ones who are asking the hospital, the hospital is Grace Park Medical Center, Ikomeru. Yes. Back on 14th of August 2024. Yes. You can call this yes. medical center, Uwaulize. Go there. Muneza tuma watu kwa ground. Okay. So, to okay. Said, okay. please, D, not your six thousand. Yes, for uh, those of you NHIF. Walikuwa na uliza kama ana NHIF. There, there are some payments that NHIF was making. Naona? That's like about Aya. six thousand. Yeah. Out of six. Uh, uh? Mkuna mtu yeah. anandika hape uh, janataka timbona tumefunika jina. Kama unataka jina yake ingine, tafadhali enda kwa kina magi. Magi ya busemu kshago kwenu ni watu, watu waende mbaka nyumbani wa verify kama uti mbaba yako. Yes, kshago kwenu ni meru. E, atuwezi yeka jina zote because TikTok does not allow you to share details about people and their medical records. This person is not here, so we are sharing their medical records, my friend. So... Kama unataka jina zake zote, itabidi uende meru ama kwa kina magitacha ushago. Sawa? Enda raka raka uende uko. Kutoka Nairobi mbaka meru ni pesa ngapi? Ni miya nane. Nani mwenye anataka hiyo nini? Keribi, ukitaka hiyo pesa tutakuchangia ufike uko. Aya, now, this is one of the hospitals, guys. Um, uende uka, uka, uka nini? Uka find out. Enda uko. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, yeah, D, you imagine, uh, uh, note, uh, NHIF walilipa 6,000 uh, out of the whole bill. This is now the whole bill as at that, this last, the latest admission. Every admission, there's no admission my dad may admit you that we pay less okay, than 60 Okay, okay, okay. Now, I'm not getting this one because yeah. this last one that you've shared, what is it about? Because it's not showing the hospital. This was now. It's not showing. Yeah, it's just, yeah, that one, ni, ni, yani ni make a picture one side with the other. Yes. Yeah, Oh. Yes. So okay. uh, the total bill. Yeah, that's why I the total bill. One hundred and fifty what? <laughs> Na unajua you know, ni magi, hebu tuende pole pole. Yes. What 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 is this yenye umeraa hapa chini? Ah, hiyo yenye umeraa hapo chini ni details hmm. za my mom. Uh, it's my mom's this was an invoice so she had to sign it. Ah, uh, hapo ni details zake, signature yake na phone number yake na ID number. That's why nimezifunika. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm only yes. asking you for for verification purposes. So guys, yeah. This is a continuation of what we had put in before. Ah, yeah. Anyway, but you know very well that this doesn't really verify the fact that your dad has cancer. Uh, so far, bada tujafika hapo. So we need to go pole pole, one by one. I really, yeah. Maggie, I really need you to do this. I really need us to make sure we put this information out there. This is just a medical bill and proof that he actually went to Meru Hospital. I really, and I like yes. the blood work thing, the hematology report. Now, let's move to the next document because what I really need right now is anything that actually shows this is what we're dealing with. Yeah. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, tell us about this. Magi.
Magi ameenda wapi? Magi ameanguka? Ah ah. Wacha nitoe hii kitu kwanza kidogo. Atarudi tu. Magi, when you when you come back let me know. Meanwhile, 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 meanwhile. Ebu tuendele hapa kidogo. Nimesikia kelele mahali. Wacha kwanza. What the hell? Kwani magi ako ghost? Magi tacha uko hapa? What is that noise in my life? Eh? Umesikia hiyo kelele ni watu? Eh? Eh? eh. Magi Nani, kama umempandisha mshukisha atakute network because ako ghost. Mm. Sijia kwa api si mwelei vali yuko. So, mnasema nipanya aje sasa. What's next? Ni click guest. And then nipanya aje what next? Guys. This is crazy. Thank you so much. What's your name? Invite. Okay, Magi, you make invite. Magi. Okay, good. I think that's way better. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Uta songesha yo sticker ya twenty one. Okay, good. Uta songesha. Thank you, Noni Gates. Okay. So we were at the uh, at uh, where my father was finally admitted last month with hematemesis. Hematemesis is vomiting of blood. He had serious hematemesis. He was weak, and um, so by the time he got to the hospital, kulikuwa na hyponatremia, kulikuwa na hypoosmolarity, na kulikuwa na uh. GIT bleeding of unknown origin. So that's why I was trying to show you guys that discharge summary because it's actually that discharge summary that has the details of how Adifika. Thank you, Upsi. Ah, yeah. Do you so have let me try to put the enhanced one? Yes, let me try to put the enhanced one. I hope it will be clear this time. I'm okay, just, good. yeah. I'm hoping it will be clear. Itajaribu clear kidogo. Yeah. Is it a bit clearer? Meanwhile, I can be reading I think, it. I think this is a bit clearer. You guys, a good name. Yeah. I so try to I, like enhance. Why it. should I should I go back? Ni ni mdogo. I don't. Uh, does it work? No. Uta, 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 there is no need to sijiweke mdogo. Iko sawa. I can read it. Eh? Okay. I can just it. be reading it as imkiangalia. So when you are not going to put screenshot, what you put? I love what I expand. Yeah, what you wear. Then this is something you can take screenshot when you zoom. So, yeah, uh, this screen, time, at any you a screen dog. You guys, do you think it would be better if I do that? A boot try hoping it won't backfire. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, this is what I am. Okay, what is that? No. Okay, guys, just take a screenshot. I love you. Expand. Explain yeah, what you want to explain, Maggie. Yeah. Wait, yeah. Wait. So, uh, so 
that dis that is a discharge family from Grace Park Hospital. That that Grace Park Hospital is a hospital in Meru. And uh, the part in blue that I've covered, that's my father's official names. Uh, you can see, Apochini, if you try to zoom that document to Taona his age, you will also see uh, his weight. Ukizumi yoki to Taona to the 44 kgs mrukwa mlani charaza na yojana, it's actually there. And then the date of admission is also written there, which was... Um, the date of admission uh, in Asoma um, 12th of August 2024, in time 1355. Um, so the digital summary says uh, uh, hypoosmolality and hyponatremia. Hyponatremia, guys, is low sodium in the body, uh, gastro, gastrointestinal hemorrhage, unspecified. So he was admitted with upper GI bleeding, varicil 1. Sawa. So from there, ukienda hapo chini unaona all the management medications zimeandikwa hapo. There was uh, they were trying to return the BP because BP ilikuwa imepotea. So utaona maana of drugs alipewa kulikuwa na fentanyl citrate, kulikuwa na ringers lactate, dextrose. Hiyo yote line ni line ya madawa zenye zilipeanwa huko. Uh, then from there you uh, there is now the now uh, the discharge medications you will see them hapo chini. Uh, there is sodium slow release, there is omeprazole, domperidone, and then there is trenet, uh, there, there is the what, the what, um, there is the paracetamol, iso dawazote zimejipanga hapo, you can read them. So, um, the summary is actually saying, uh, the summary ukuchini inasema vile alikuja it says uh, patient came with history of vitamio uh, kutapika damu uh, massive weight loss low hb all those zini andikuwa hapo chini uh, ndiyo daktari ya me explain hapo na imeandikuwa duration of, of imatemesis imatemesis in medical terms simply means kutapika damu uh, imeandikuwa the patient has been in imatemesis for like one month yeah um, they have even indicated there that there was an OGD that was ordered. So OGD ni endoscopy. So uh, this was ordered because they needed to know the origin ya mali ana bleed. Yeah, iyo damu because blood ni fresh. They needed to know iyo damu anatapikia wapi. So after kustabilizewa, bipizi merudi and all that, he was taken to endoscopy. Waka ingisha endoscopy. After kuingisha endoscopy, that's when they went and found something interesting. They found uh, a tumor that has, ne 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 that has necrosis. And is that, that's actually where the active bleeding was coming from because they also noticed the viruses with the necrosis. Necrosis in medicine, you can the word necrosis in a manisha kidonda. A kidonda, a row, a row kidonda. And the tumor is just kikitu kime grow up. Um, that could, might or might not be cancerous. So because the doctors wanted now to know, is this cancer or what are we looking at? That is when they now decided to take a biopsy. They decided to take a biopsy for histology. So let me post for you the histology results that came back after one week. Just a minute. Yeah, thank you. On twenty on on the fourteenth of August, uh, and the specimen was collected. Um, collection date. Just a minute, guys. Let me open it properly. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Yeah. Just a minute. With prominent nucleus. This is vascular, uh, there is vascular space invasion um, and necrosis as is identified. And then it now says diagnosis invasive poorly differentiated carcinoma. So for those who are asking, and this report was done by Dr. Atandi, Dr. Atandi D at Path, Path Care. 
Kenya Limited. They are the ones who did this histology report. Dr. Atandi, um, we were given this report on the 16th of August, 2024. So for those who are asking, how do I know that my father has cancer? There is the histology report. That's the biopsy. So from there, uh, we went back to the, to the Grace Park View Hospital in Meru Town. Uh, and they said that my father will need further management. Because from this point on, we need to know at what stage the cancer is at. Histology is, does not identify the stage. He will need to come, to, he needed, that's why they forwarded him to KNH, where they can now do further investigations to, do, uh, to, 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 to know the stage. And also they need to know whether it has metastasized or not. And that is why the doctor told us, when we are going for our appointment, which we, we were given now, appointment in the OE and yet KNH, let me post it, just a minute. Let me post the appointment. Yeah, this is the KNH appointment. This one. That one. That's the KNH appointment. And when you look at that thing, Nivile screen sai. Nivile screen is divided. If you can check, it was written agent. And the reason why they ticked agent is because my dad is not uh, in a state ya kungoja long. Normally, cancer cures are very long, guys. Is it clinics? What were our party? Karibu, unawezaenda ata wambu kuja after two months, after three months, evo. But when they saw the way my dad was, wakatika waka wakandika urgent. And that's why we were given that date, yenye tuwepatiwa ya next week. So next week, ndiyo wanaenda kufanya wajue staging. And also we know the further management, but they said they need to do further investigations because even this report in Asema, there is need for further uh, immunological studies on what kind of tumor it is. The tumor is, in that report it says the tumor is between the lower part of the esophagus and the upper part of the stomach. There is necrosis, active bleeding because it has invaded the stomach tissue. That's what he said. You can zoom to Vizuri Utaiona. So that is it, guys. He, Nikayanech Cancer Center. My dad's first name is Tidium. So Kama wewe unaweza kuenda upewe information hapo KNH that there is a patient by the name Stephen who has been referred from Meru and akuja treatment hapo KNH, feel free. Because me I have nothing to hide. Na mimi siyezi kuja hapa ni kadanganya. My father came from Meru a week ago with that referral. And KNH wali muwana tu hivi. Akapewa appointment for the following week immediately. That should tell you that his situation is dire because if it wasn't trust you me guys and get away kwa pengine ata next year january ama ata february but always in goja guys in goja so that's why wali mpeyo na wakatu ambia tuende kama tumejitayarisha because on that day there are some things we are gonna have to do and that is why i came here nukatema na itaji usaidizi i am in a fix kona nhif Yes, but NHIF does not cover everything. Iyo hospital ye inaitua Grace Park, yenye my father alilala. Guys, I can tell you here and now, they only paid for bed. The bill, iyo nile bill tu nilikuwa nimepostia Diana before. Let me show you guys. Let me show you that bill. Let me show you the way that thing is looking. Just a minute. Now, what you're seeing here on the screen, that was the... The final bill of 63,193 shillings. And out of he biliote, NHIF only paid 6,000. The rest of the money in Sisi to Nilipa. And I'm telling you guys, since 2020, isn't it bills to make what to Kilipa? And then Alala, to Najapa Bilia 50. And then Alala Tena, to Najapa Bilia 60,000. 
anaenda na lala tena tuna chapa bill ya 70 unaona and in those in, in all those uh, wakati alikuwa anaenda analazo hospitali NHIF used to pay actually less than 10% of the total bill then there are some things like some some of the investigations they will not pay kama hata hiyo endoscopy yenye tulimpeleka we have to pay cash we have to pay for endoscopy cash 7500 for the histology pia hiyo we have to pay kando you understand so um mimi sijawahi kuja hapa nikamwambia baba yangu ni mgonjo and from 2020 has been sick amekuwa in and out of hospital and we've been paying bills na sijawahi kukuja hapa nikawaambia munipatie pesa nani ngoja kwanza moderators Magitacha cannot be disrespected on my life, not even one minute. If you see anybody trying to disrespect her on this life, block them. Don't even mute. If you have a question, I was very clear. You send a request and you come up. Now, Ulise Swali. But you will not insult any of my guests on my platform. I don't do that kind of nonsense. You will be blocked. Now. Aya nani ebu tuma request umesema ni ku up ebu nione umetuma request Maureen Salama unataka nini my dear Andika hapo chini unataka nini Maureen Salama Hi D hi D how are you doing Ah uh, Maggi eh, eh di nilikuwa nataka kuongelea hiyo kitu ya kansa kidogo I've been through that journey with my mom na tulikuwa tunaenda hapo Meru Ah uh, have you tried Doctor's Plaza uh, No we didn't we didn't uh, did. yeah we felt mm. like we just needed to ref to bring that to KNH uh, quick So thank you so much for watching the video to the end remember to like share comment and if you have not subscribed please make sure you subscribe and put on the notification bell so that you know every time i post a new video so guys thank you i'm gonna see you on my next video bye